Staying with national sporting matters, this time with our national women's football team. We're drawing closer to the kickoff in Banyana Banyana's second leg of final round Olympic qualifier against Nigeria. Banyana trail 1 0 from the first leg played last Friday in Abuja. Newsroom Africa's Guya Makoba is outside of Loftus Fastfelt. He joins us once again. Vuyo Safa just releasing the starting 11 for Desiree Ellis's charges and a couple of changes from the team that started in Nigeria. Hilda Machai on the bench along with Nokumutlo. Good evening to you once again, Valen, and to the Newsroom Africa viewers. Definitely, we've just seen the starting lineup now that, of course, Safa has put out with Desiree in the starting level for Banyana Banyana for tonight. We're seeing a couple of changes, as you've mentioned, the likes of Noko Matlo and the likes of Hilda Machaya. And in a sense, I've had a touch with some of the fans who I'm going to just speak to now, bringing in Utula Ningobo later on a bit, just to reflect on it in this starting lineup. You know, when he starts looking at the front, he seals a Tembi Khatlana, Jermaine Seposenu, and then you're looking at another striker in Hilda Machaya. What is Desiree Ellis trying to do? We're going to bring in, of course, Utula Ningobo to come and have a chat with us. But there's, there's one thing that I just want to touch on with you, Valim. I'm not sure if you remember in France last year at the Rugby World Cup you met Mama Choi on the other side and of course there was a conversation that came out after that with Mama Choi being in France we got to learn about Papa Choi um, and that story now is that a point where it could possibly continue and as important as it is for South Africans for Banyana Banyana to qualify and go to France for Mama Joy, that is the case. She joins me now before. I've just asked her to join me very quickly before she goes into the stadium. Mama Joy, important that, yes, Banyana Banyana qualifies. But for you specifically, it gives you an opportunity to reunite with Papa Joy. I just want Banyana Banyana to win. Because if they don't win, oh, uh, no, how am I going to see Papa Joy again? <laughs> so Banyana Banyana, you might, if you don't do it for South Africa, do it for me to see my Papa Joy. Please, Banyana Banyana, I'm begging you tonight. It's a do or a die. But we know, Banyana Banyana, you're going to do it because I trust you. And uh, Nigeria, uh, they won't see anything. They won't see you when you come. They will only see you when we go out of the stadium and it was 3 nil. So we, that's a 3-0 for, for us that's qualifying us for the Olympics? We are going to qualify. There's no way Mama Joy can see Papa Joy in France. Banyana Banyana is going to do it for Mama Joy. Mama Joy, I know you still got an important mission where you need to go and sit with the fans and, of course, lead them um, as you shout for Banyana Banyana. So I'm going to just let you go um, to go inside and start your chance inside. I know it's important. You've got a very, very important seat inside. Thank you. Banyana Banyana! Do it for me. Do it for Papa Joy. Thank you. Uh, Valen, I know you had asked in terms of the starting lineup, but I mean, I had to bring that story in because, of course, for South Africans, this is an opportunity for them to see that sequel where Mama Joy gets to reunite with Papa Joy. But I want to bring in another South African friend in Tulani Ngobo now just to look at that starting lineup. I mean, I've showed you Tulani um, reflecting on the first game, starting lineup. We're seeing Hilda Machaya now in the bench. Um, we're seeing Enoko Matlo also in the bench. These are people that understand what it is to play at this stage of competition. They've been with the national team for the longest time. Time. What is Desiree Ellis trying to do here? Uh, thank you, thank you, Vuyo, and thank you to the viewers of, of Newsroom. Um, let me just touch a little bit on Papa Joy and Mama Joy. Uh, I was talking to her earlier on, and she said, and I, t I said to her, uh, you must make sure that you go there, Banyana Banyana must win, uh, so that, so that we, you can bring baby joy here because we, we need we need baby joy so when it comes to yeah exactly when we when it comes to the starting lineup i think desri is looking for goals understand i is looking for goals so maybe when they are tired and then he, he'll, he'll put uh, mahaila inside so i'm happy with musalo i'm happy with uh sopo Singwen in front i'm also happy with uh Tembi yeah they are, they are, if they don't become selfish towards each other and wanna uh, uh take the glory uh, and the individual glory, we are definitely going to win this one. What we, do we need to do different than what we did in the first leg or what we did not do in the first yeah. leg? 
first leg we're playing a, a low block and I could see that you know they don't want to concede a goal but unfortunately that penalty you know uh, made them you know to, to concede a goal but but for for, for, for this for this uh, uh, for today I for tonight they need to make sure that they don't play uh, 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 the low block that they play that side, they must make sure that first 10 minutes we get two goals, at least we know that we'll be fine. You know, Nigerians, they are very good. They, uh, they beat us in penalties in the AFCON, and, and, and now it's a revenge uh, for, 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 for Afana Afana. So I need, I, uh, we need uh, 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 that, that, goal, that, uh, that, that, that win so that we can go to the Olympics. Last time we, did we, did we qualify for the Olympics? No. The last time we didn't. We didn't, yeah. So we must make sure that we, we win this, this, this game for us to qualify for the for so those are the scenes that you are seeing here at Loftus Stadium, Valen. I guess the confidence that's coming in from the Banyana Banyana fans like Mama Joy with the bigger occasion for her to reunite with Papa Joy in France. So Banyana Banyana needs to do it not just for South Africans but also for Umama Joy. And in terms of that starting lineup, seeing the guys of Tembi Khatlana, seeing the German uh, um, Sipo Senwe leading the front and of course the likes of Refilo Chan and Lindo Botalo in the middle, those are the guys that of course they will need to step, step up for Banyana Banyana here. The likes of Hilda being on the bench as well, whenever there's a striker in front who's not performing to their best, she's there available as a fresh player uh, to come in and, and, and step up in, in that front line. We know her experience, we know also the likes of Noko Matlo having been with the national team for the longest of years, what they can do. So those are the guys that, that are going to be on the bench, sitting on the bench, but then when the opportunity, when one of the players is not playing at their best, they can fit in those positions, having understood the magnitude of this game. The scenes that you are seeing here, some of the fans with the calls that have come in for Banyanaba fan, fans to come through to the uh, Lofter Stadium and give their sub full support. I can tell you now, Valen, that we're seeing a large number of fans that have walked in here today. Kind of a similar scenes, of course, that we saw when it came to the times when we're meeting in the different spaces, the fan bases, when Bafana Bafana was playing Nigeria in the semi-finals of AFCON. Nigerians that are here holding up their flags, of course South Africans as well are here holding up their fans. And in closing, one of the things that Coach Rulani spoke about in the build-up to the game against Yanga SC, when he was calling on Sundown's fans to come and support, is to say, if ever there was a time that fans need to worship the team, this is the time. So if there was ever a time that fans need to come to the stadium and worship this team and give their full support to this team, this is the time. It's back to you in studio. Thank you very much, Vuyo. Certainly something very positive to see for women's sport. A fantastic turnout for a midweek clash. Also an all-important clash for Banyana Banyana.